is some music, finally, this afternoon that you'll recognise. <laughs> By choosing that version, I've probably dated myself. And yeah, I've been watching the new series of Doctor Who and loving it. Who couldn't resist the chance to play a bit of Doctor Who for you there? You may have heard of the TARDIS. You've certainly heard of the TARDIS. Someone's even tweeted me a picture of a TARDIS cake this afternoon. But what about the Laodis? That's clever, isn't it? Blue phone boxes are about to invade the city of Lees. They're very high-tech. And who better to explain high-tech matters than the Doctor himself? In this case, Dr Adam Beaumont. Nice to see you, Adam. How are you? <laughs> Good to see you again. Twice in two days. It is. Adam's <laughs> one of our regular Wednesday Witter guests, and he's uh, back with us today from uh, AQL, high-tech company, based just south of Leeds City Centre in the uh, Hunslet area. Blow phone boxes. What's the idea, Adam? Well, um, we're, we're, a, we're a telecoms operator based in Leeds. Um, so think of us um, like uh, Kingston Communication in, in Hull or, or BT nationally, but we're, we're a lot smaller. But we're, we're a national telco, but our... our our main HQ has always been Leeds, and um, we're looking to expand our, our metropolitan network around Leeds for more connectivity. And we were looking at what kind of street cabinets we could actually put this this equipment in. And um, you've got a choice of these really murky-looking green cabinets, and we thought we wanted to do something a little bit more exciting. So we thought we'd restore some of the old 1935 um, Giles Scott uh, K6 phone boxes, the old um, well, iconic... I think a quintessential phone box. Yeah, yeah the, the iconic phone box. Um, so, so we've uh, we've purchased a load of these, and we've been restoring them. It's taken quite a while because they're they're uh, they're quite delicate, and they need shot blasting and powder coating. And we're ready to deploy around twenty four of those around Leeds. So, where will you where will you put them? Have you got a sort of strategy for them? Yeah. So, we want to start off with South Leeds. So, our our data centres in Leeds are the best connected buildings in Yorkshire, and they're they're almost in the centre of Leeds, or on the south side of the river. And it just it seems a shame that if we've got all this connectivity, why don't we share some of it and, and offer free Wi-Fi and a few other things to, to the public? So, 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 yes, practically speaking, what will they be used for? Because you're actually hoping to get stuff from the people who go into them, aren't you? Yeah, sure. So so part of it, it houses our network equipment to allow us to take our network around, around leads. We have to have somewhere to actually break the network out so that we can deliver... Uh, connectivity to businesses. So in other words, that's, it's, it's a functional thing for you, but is, someone yeah. going in there, because you can still use it, is going to be able to give something back, yeah, aren't we, they? Well, you, ca you can't actually get into it. I noticed there was a, there was a tweet, um, will they smell like other phone boxes? Um, <laughs> They're going to so, be locked up with the equipment <laughs> yeah. safely inside. But. So, so, so we're adding a, a bit of a twist of technology. So the, the actual um, it, phone interface and interactive part of it will be a touch screen actually on the glass of the phone box. So the phone boxes will be locked with our equipment inside and you can touch a screen to make calls, um, and to, to, to find out uh, information about the local area, but also to leave video blogs. So if you've got any memories or anything you want to share with anybody else, you can actually leave a video diary with the phone box, and we're going to archive that, and then we're going to work with, uh, with Leeds and Partners um, to make that available. To what a lovely idea. So someone literally standing outside, this is very Doctor Who, isn't it? Standing outside the TARDIS with who knows what going on inside, and you'll be able to leave your thoughts, memories, everything else. Ab absolutely. Historical thoughts, um, how, how, how that location was when they were a child, um, so this is the kind of stuff that's priceless. Um, so if you see the site leodis.org, which is um, still images of... Um, There's some of, great shots on there, yeah, aren't there? absolutely. Um, so I thought so. I'd bring that back, just to give you a bit of uh, atmos for it. Uh, are you worried about security? Is it? Is it? Um, because they're all part of our network, um, we, we monitor them anyway, so we, we know what's going on with anyone with, any, with, with them, whether they're, they're being um, uh, abused um, or, or whatever. I so, understand. Big Brother can watch. Yeah. When will they be up and running? Um, we're hoping for a rollout over the next six months. So the first few you should start to see appearing in South Leeds in the next in the next few weeks. So keep an eye out for them. Um, they're in kind of strategic locations where we think there's going to be either a lot of footfall or there's a, or there's a lot of uh, flats or residents. Um, so so the, we'll be rolling out the free Wi-Fi in South Leeds first because Lovely South idea. Leeds needs it. Dr Adam Beaumont from AQL, based in South Leeds. Is it the right music for my time? Is it the right one for you? Spot on. Spot on, good. Nice to see you, Adam. Thanks so very much indeed. Back. We'll let Doctor Who play us out.